Well, hello there. How good of you to come. Director, I've been looking forward to speaking with you, Uncle. <laughs> it's been some time since we last met, Alisa. And these must be your classmates. I thought you were raised with better manners than this. Did you not think to make an appointment before seeing me? We apologize for the sudden intrusion. However, I'm afraid the business we came here for simply can't wait. Is that so? We're short on time, so let me get straight to the point. You don't belong behind that desk. You just don't have what it takes. So I think it's about time you dropped this pathetic act and returned it to its rightful owner. Really now? Those are some very provocative words coming from you, Sister Angelica. You took advantage of the chaos caused by this war to imprison the chairman of the Reinford Group and steal control from her. And as if that weren't shameful enough, you steal her home and treat it like your own. How can you call yourself a noble? Maybe it's not clear to you how angry I am. I'm annoyed with father as well, but your actions are an utter disgrace. Thank you, Angelica. Now get yourself out from behind that desk before I have to drag you my way. I've no intention of standing back and allowing you to bring shame to the Rogner family name one second longer. You really are so much like your father. You two limit your own potential through that wretched, worthless sense of pride. And for what? He won't even bother to stake his rightful claim as Supreme Commander of the Noble Alliance. He leads one of the prestigious four great houses, and yet he consistently sits back and lets others rise above him. Pitiful, no? I'm sure he'd be none too pleased to be called pitiful by you of all people. But that's neither here nor there. I intend to settle my differences with Father soon enough. Just as soon as I've finished arresting you. <laughs> Fools the lot of you. Director, please, won't you consider backing down on this? I came here to try and return the Reinford Company and this city to the way they used to be. You've always had a respectable position in the company. What will it take to get your cooperation? I'm afraid nothing you say will inspire me to back down, Elisa. This is a nation at war, and your naive line of thinking isn't going to cut it anymore! Active camouflage? What's this giant archaism doing here? I thought I sensed something strange in the breeze flowing in here. Seven targets located. Switching to elimination mode. Combat abilities analyzed. Deploy Chigurians. We're surrounded! It couldn't be. Isn't his blade and stance similar to yours, Reen? It seems to have the Eight Leaves School programmed into it. I thought you seemed oddly relaxed, given the circumstances. <laughs> now look who has the upper hand! I'll tell my brother you died in a most unfortunate accident. I'm sure he'll buy it! Chigurians deployed successfully. Commencing elimination of all targets. Here it comes! We can't afford to lose! Let's take it out! This one's dangerous. Stay on your toes. I'll handle it. Move. This 
second story. Come out! Gotcha! I can do this. Light! Rain upon us! Too slow. Of course! Analyzing the enemy's vitals. Analysis complete! Too slow. Got it. I'll back you up! Let's move! My turn. Okay. Here goes. Okay. Eliminating target now. I'll back you up. Right. Eliminating targets. My turn. Ha! Now! Gotcha! Right. Light! Rain upon us! Of course! Let's move. There! Ha! Now's our chance. Gotcha! My turn. Eliminating target. Got it. Let's go! Ha! Here I go! Arc is active! I can do this! Okay. Eliminating target now. I'll back you up. Let's move. Ha! Now. Gotcha. Ha! Let's move. Handle it. Eliminating target now. I'll back you up. I can do this. Light. Rain upon us. Of course. Ethereal, go for it. Too slow now. My turn. Ha! 
my turn. My turn! Now! Gotcha! Now! Right! Right! Rain upon us! Okay. One, two, and done. My turn! My turn. Now! I can do this. Light! Rain upon us! Here I go! I'll handle it. Here I go. Ha! It's my turn. Ethereal, go for it. No problem. Here I go. Overdrive. My turn! Now! Gotcha! Right! Fire! Now! Got you! Okay. And done. My turn! I can do this! Battle's over, but stay alert, everyone! Great! Ah, I'm so glad! Success! I'm so glad! I've got it! <laughs> That's about right. No complaints here. <laughs> what? We did it. Looks like you're all out of aces now, Uncle. This can't be happening. That had the combat data of Crossbow's Divine Blade of Wind installed into it! How could it be defeated by a bunch of mere children? Its power and speed were impressive, I'll give you that. But that's all it had going for it. No matter whose data it had programmed into it, it's just a machine without a soul. And without its bearer pouring their soul into it, no blade can reveal its true potential. Ah, spare me your nonsense! Well then, you leave me no choice but to call all the archaisms in this building to this room! Don't waste your time. Mother? Sharon? Huh. I guess everything went all right on your end? It certainly did. All the building's security systems are under my control now. 
every one of the archaisms inside it has been disabled as well. I'm afraid it's over for you, Master Heidel. <laughs> Madam Chairman! You've got this all wrong! Yes, I was acting under the orders of the higher-ups in the Alliance. I swear on my life I didn't want to do any of this. You have my compliments for managing to outwit me. I gained my position by doing the same to the former chairman, so I'm in no position to criticize you for your actions. I won't fault a man for being ambitious. As a person of similar ambition, you made the correct choice. I... I, I did? But waltzing in and making yourself comfortable in my family's home is an offense you need to be punished for. Ah! Hey! Oh. Oh. <laughs> Damn! What a splendid volley of blows, Madam Chairman. She really is your mother, Elisa. <sighs> That means things are back to normal, I guess. Why are you still standing around here? You can leave everything here to me. Don't you have something else you need to do? Ah! Yes, that's true. She's right. Let's get going. Right you are. Looks like our escorts are here to pick us up, too. Courageous! It must be here to pick us up! Rain! Angie! I take it everything went well in there? I think it's about time to wrap things up. Hurry and get on board! Now the preparations are all complete. Time for Father and I to settle our family dispute once and for all. Cool. Looks like my volunteers are ready to go. I'll see you later. Good luck, and take care. Just be careful, okay? Don't worry about me. I'll be just fine. Even should I fail and end up tossed into the fiery depths of hell, I'll crawl my way back up again. For not even hell could keep me away from this land rife with beautiful ladies. Truly, I have found Shangri-La. <laughs> you remind me so much of my brother. You know we're worried about you, right? This isn't the time for jokes, Angie. It's, you might be going to fight your dad, but this is still a war. Oh, I know. Even if he knows I'm his opponent, no. Be because he knows I'm his opponent. My own man won't hold back in the slightest. So neither will I. It took me too long to find you guys. The last thing I want is to be taken away from you forever. Well, as long as you understand what's at stake. Come back safely, Angie. We'll be praying for your success. Thanks. All right, now it's my turn to take care of my own problems. You just sit back and watch, okay? Right! <laughs> hmm. 
nice. Looks like it works just fine. Lady Angelica! All units, we will hereby begin advancing on the short straight barrier. Brave heroes of Nortia, lend me your strength! It is only with your aid that I will be able to defeat my father and secure this province's rightful future! Yes, ma'am! Your Lordship! What is it? Why are you so flustered? I thought you should hear this as soon as possible, sir. The Reinford building has been attacked. Lord Heidel was arrested! What? Are you certain of this? Y yes, sir! In addition, Lady Angelica is leading several soldats in this direction. I imagine they are being piloted by a small number of our very own. Uh, that good-for-nothing daughter! Huh? Where are you going? What do you want? You off to settle the score with your daughter? Let me lend a hand. I didn't come all this way to do nothing. You stay out of this. This has nothing to do with you, or even the Noble Alliance. This is a father disciplining his child for going one step too far. You remain here and stay on alert for the 3rd Armored Division coming from the Nord Highlands. <laughs> Look at him getting all fired up. He's alright in my book. Can't say I'm a huge fan of getting in the way of a family matter like this. But this is too good a chance to pass up. The situation is really tense down there. It feels like they could start fighting at any moment. Good luck, Angelica. Lady Angelica! Something's happening in the fortress! That looks like... Can you hear me, Angelica? Father! I'll commend you! for arresting Director Rodner and making it all the way to me. But I'm not going to let success go to your head any further. It's time for your father to personally give you some stern discipline for all your transgressions. Y your Lordship! It couldn't be. Is he challenging her to a one-on-one -on -one duel? <laughs> I knew this is what would happen. Very well, Father. What say you and I get down to business? Begin! Begin! Is that it, Angelica? Is that all your Eastern martial arts can muster? Yeah. I'm more concerned for you, Father. You'll need more than just raw strength to win against a Taito practitioner. Ah, uh, say what you will! Good luck, Lady Angelica! Yep. This is more like watching a family feud than an all-out war. But with robots. 
I think the robot thing alone makes it pretty different from most family feuds. Still, at least they can communicate honestly with one another, even if they have to use their fists to do it. Soldiers seem to be completely enthralled by the battle, too. Marquis's soldat might have the upper hand in terms of raw power and defense, but Angie's clearly spent a lot of time practicing so that she can use her Taito skills while on hers. Looks that way, yeah. I think this fight will end up being decided by a single moment. Go on, Angie. Oh, no! <sighs> Give up and accept your defeat. You don't stand a chance against this Hector soul in hand-to-hand -to -hand combat. So hurry up and resign yourself to the inevitable. Before yours ends up smashed to pieces with you in it! Huh. There's no way to know how a duel is going to end until it's over. That was a little something I learned from a friend who loved it with Gamble. Gotta say though, getting all worked up like that can't be good for your blood pressure. You're not getting any younger. Uh, enough! Allow me to finish you off! She sent a big old thing like that flying! That's her zero impact! Yeah, this fight's done. That was a close one, but I pulled through in the end. Heh. <laughs> I didn't expect for you to have an ace like that up your sleeve. I suppose that's another thing you must have learned after you ran away from home. You couldn't be less like a noble if you tried. Uncle Haida was right, though. I sure as hell take after you. You were the one that taught me that true Erebonian nobles must always be able to stand on their own two feet. Those words have always stuck with me, you know. It looks as though I've no choice. <sighs> looks like it's finally over. Thank goodness. Now we can... Sorry, but this ain't over just yet. What? Another new model? It's gigantic! Hey there, your lordship. I came to spoil your reunion. What is the meaning of this? I told you not to interfere! And besides, the battle has already been! Maybe so. But with the crimson wings in the sky, I ain't gonna just sit back and do nothing. I've got a job to do. And me and this here Goliath are gonna do it! How dare you harm Lady Angelica! Move away from his lordship at once! Such impertinent behavior will not be- Shut it! I ain't got time for weaklings! Unless you wanna end up dead, stay the hell away from me! power is incredible. But there's no way a soul dot that massive moving like that's gonna hold out for long. Come on now! You don't think you can sit back and watch from up there now that me and Goliath are out, do you? Get down here! It's our turn! Rain Schwarzer! Uh, it's him, isn't it? Yep, that's Vulcan. Wasn't he one of Crow's friends from the Imperial Liberation Front? I guess he wants a revenge match after losing to us in the mine. What are you going to do, Lane? Velimar's ready to go at any time, so if you're set on fighting... I am. And he's right. I can't just sit back and watch. It's time we finally settle the score with him. He 
take care, Reen. He's an exceptionally dangerous foe, to say nothing of the soldat he's piloting. Good luck. Thanks. There you go. It's the Ash Collar. Here comes the star of the show. Kick some ass, Reed! Let's do this, Valimar! Together, we can disable that thing! Acknowledged. <laughs> Man, you don't know how long I've been waiting for this. Couldn't ask for a better stage. We got no chance for interruptions. This is perfect. So let's go! Rain Schwarzer! This'll be a tough one. Be careful! My turn. Good luck. All right, let's get this started. Huh? Allow me! Yes. 
this! Impressive achievement, considering how stacked the odds were against him. Oh, yeah! That's our Reef! <laughs> I knew someone who was in the same class as C would put up a good fight. Sure, I might have lost this fight too, but I couldn't have wished for my flame to burn brighter one last time. First step? I knew it! Watch out, Reen! Don't get too close! Supporting a frame that huge was putting a massive strain on that thing's orbital engine. It could blow any minute now. And the blast will probably take the whole soul dot with it. What? Vulcan! Get out of there quickly! If you don't hurry, you're gonna die! Sorry. But this is just how I wanted it to be. I did what I set out to do. I can't say I don't have regrets. But I'm satisfied, at least. Are you an idiot? If you go and die, it all amounts to nothing! <laughs> I died a long time ago. I've been dead since the day that bastard had the others in Arngarm slaughtered. At least now, I can finally be reunited with them, and she... Anyway, try and give Scarlet and Crow the end to all of this that they want too. See ya. Reed! Get away from him! <laughs> Happen. 